Forking awesome. Ready? TikTok. Uh. <laughs> 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 this, believe it or not, is my favorite bike because it's super weird. Uh, it's a Soma Tradesman. I just want funny, fun graphics that, that represent you know, the fun. What's up guys, this is Calaboca coming at you from Orange County, California. And this is my garage of doom. Is that good? I'm an artist that's worked in the, the action sports industry for like 30 years. I like to ride bicycles and draw pictures and ride surfboards. Not particularly in that order. This is a collection of some of my stuff. Okay, let's get stepping. <laughs> so lame, dude! Oh my god! Some of you might know me from SDG Components. I did this handy little bear saddle Oso. out now <laughs> my collection these are people that i really respect for their craft um or stuff they make things okay. oh i made these lights um my my buddy third eye um he we did this collab and i made these little headlamps and they're pretty cool this is my friend that protects me from evil spirits. And he, she is from Indonesia. Isn't she pretty? <laughs> Her tongue's not pretty long. How's that? Yeah, I have a problem with surfboards. Um, <coughs> yeah, so I like to paint the boards on the foam. It's a real pain in the butt and it takes lots of time, but it just looks really nice. I painted this one. This is my little bat board. It's a little quad, quaddy, quadzilla. Um, and this is like inspired by Indonesian wood carvings. Here we got another variant on EC's mini Simmons with the uh, happy pineapple, I suppose. What was the inspiration behind the pineapple? Um, well, my family is from Hawaii, so yeah, aloha. This is a hand-painted, uh, hand-shaped plywood fin that EC cut and sanded, and then I did a little gouache painting on it, a little, uh, little tiger to match the, the deck, which is done by Golden State Glassing. Jason, you're awesome. So um, this is the ink drawing that became the saddle, the Oso. This is like what happens when you take coffee and sit with a pen for five hours. And then you can, <laughs> you can go, wham! And is that the original? This is the original. Yeah, this is the original pen work. This is my book that's coming out. It's called How We Roll. And it's about people that ride their bikes for pleasure or transport utility, whatever. And so what was the story behind it? So um, I just take photos of people riding their bikes whenever I see them out. That's kind of creepy. So, yeah, so I do drive around and, and take pictures of people riding their bikes because it's cool, man. And then, you know, they don't know, but then, then I sit there and I draw them. I, you know, I draw them with pen and ink and, and keep them in my sketchbooks and Here's some of these characters. These are all handmade. These are all hand drawn. Yep. This one was in Hawaii. Harbor Boulevard. That's a bartender. <laughs> and how much is it? 20 bucks. And where can you buy it from? <laughs> uh, uh, see, I don't have a link yet to that, dude. Okay. Well, oh, just... Instagram. Oh, on my Instagram. 
So if you want to pick one of the, <laughs> dude, you can't laugh at me while I haven't even You're said anything. You're doing great. Anything. You're doing great. <laughs> Just give me a DM on Instagram, Calaboca, and they're for sale. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So I'm a bike hoarder, a bike snob, whatever you want to call it. I, I know I, it, it's a problem. I, I, I acknowledge it. Okay. What do you want to know about this? Here's a gravel bike. It's fun. It has 29 inch wheels. <laughs> <laughs> It goes fast. This is my road bike. Yeah, put that in. This is as close to I get as a road bike. It has 50 C tires on it. It's pretty, pretty cushy. It's a Kona. Kona Libre. This, believe it or not, is my favorite bike because it's super weird. Uh, it's a Soma Tradesman uh, utility frame or basket bike. And I built this with my neighbor woodworker, this box, so that I can do this when I go to the beach. The way this works is you just take the board, plop it right here, like this, and you're ready to go. Carbon rear rim, because why not? Custom banana seat, 20 inch front wheel, 26 inch rear. <laughs> this is an NS eccentric steel, cause steel is real. This is like a really cool slack, low, modern geo hardtail. And I splatter painted it with one shot. This is a Krampus and it's heavy and it's steel and rigid and fun and the tires buzz a lot and it's cool um these are some really cool bars from this guy in, in colorado odd money odd cycles um they're titanium they cost more than the frame <laughs> cut that i don't <laughs> want to tell anybody that dude <laughs> oh my god Kobe! Long live Kobe. Hey, was this your tribute piece? This is my tribute. Yeah, cause you know, we'd actually see him from time to time at the Starbucks down at the bottom of the trail in Newport Coast. Oh, I just put some brand new kicks on it. And these are like really fast rolling terror veils. Um, more XC. This is my XC bike, how's that? I've had this for 15 years. It's uh, ANT, which is Mike Flanagan from Independent Fab. And this is a recreation of an old 40s race bike based off Major Taylor, who is the first black athlete to actually be admitted into like cycling, even though he was discriminated against. Like he was, and he was just a monster. He just crushed it in the, velod the velodrome. Um, yeah, I know, you already have a gravel bike. What What the hell, what gives, man? But this is steel, and this is bad. This is a crust Bombora. Steel, um, super thin, super flexy. You should film that. Why is the Mega Tower so popular? Why, because it's new, and it has 180 gigabytes of freaking suspension? <laughs> hate, haters gonna hate. Go ahead and hate. Motorhead don't care. <laughs> uh, this is my big bike for, for trips to the Pacific Northwest and beyond. <laughs> uh, 20, no, wait, what year is this? 19? Your bike number. Is it 20, it's a 20, <laughs> uh, well, you know the model. Is it 2019? I think it's it 2019, 2019. A flagship of engineering, if I must say. T-Line. Okay, so I'm starting a little brand called Derailed Mountain Bike or Made to Bike. Yeah, you know, I'm not really into like racing stripes and, and techie, uber, crazy, blah, graphics all over. I just want funny, fun graphics that, that represent, you know, the fun. Like the goats that clean Laguna Canyon for you. So a fire doesn't happen, that didn't make sense. Ugh. 
These are all hand drawn and inked by hand. And then they appear on a t-shirt. If you don't like e-bikes, hey, have your voice heard, man. Cause not everybody likes e-bikes yet. So I'm, try I'm doing little shout outs to some of the iconic trails in the area. A little surfy surf, Sweaty Palms Beach Club, Dolphin. You know, I just, uh, I just make stuff I think's funny. Here's another trail, kind of infamous Laguna Trail with the car wreck. Who doesn't like luchadors? This is my little Mexican wrestler poster shout out. Yeah, these are just a few of the ones in the line. I have about, uh, I have about five, five or six more designs coming. Um, check out derailed MTV. Dot com? Dot com. Yes, sir. Uh, we'll, we'll put the information on the website here and in the description, so definitely go check it out. Thanks, guys, for checking out my studio. And... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. How can people find wait, 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 wait. you? How can people find wait, wait. you? Wait. Um, You're doing great. <laughs> I always start off so good. <laughs> Dude, it's, that's, you told me to tell, like, say like 20 things in, in a No, row. you're so... Okay, how can wait. people find um, you? You can find me at Calaboca on Instagram. Wait, you can find me on Instagram at, Cal at Calaboca. You can find me on Instagram. <laughs> Stop laughing, dude. I can't talk if you're laughing, dude. Oh my God.